found out about Love Your Home through a friend. I've seen a couple of influencers as well on Instagram and it's always been on my radar. But what I really like with interiors is just a sense of coziness. I don't like anything too stark. Comfort, welcoming, and I really felt like I could get that sense from Love Your Home. So we've lived here for four years now and we have done quite a lot to it actually. It was a bit of a blank canvas when we first moved in. I'm kind of drawn to navy and pink in our living dining room space. We'd already painted the dining room this kind of dark, rich navy colour and I felt like it would be quite nice to tie that in with a navy sofa. Hence why we chose this gorgeous stain resistant velvet which I believe is French navy. The team suggested that I might like to pipe the sofa in a slightly different fabric which is a linen in another navy colour but I'm so glad that we went with that because I just think it creates a really nice touch, a slightly different texture is always really nice in a space and it ties it really beautifully with the cushions as well. I also wanted a bit of print. I think that was something that I was quite keen to incorporate because I was really drawn to this Tobias and the Angel fabric, which we've got in the footstool as well. I just think it's so cool. It really brings the space to life and actually it's the thing that people comment on the most. So if you're in doubt about incorporating this print, then 100% just, just go for it. I do take real joy sitting down on a Sunday afternoon reading a print magazine sometimes. I have to be honest, I probably do consume most of my media online now, like a lot of us do, but there is something really nice about sitting with a physical magazine, not looking at a screen. But often I will buy Vogue, and I do really like Elle magazine as well. I think it probably heralds back to my Hearst magazine days. I feel a sense of loyalty. There's definitely something nice about that, sitting on your sofa on a Sunday afternoon.